challenge. If you do this challenge all the way through, you are going to feel so sculpted and so strong through your beautiful legs. Make sure you subscribe to my channel if you haven't yet, and then you can go ahead and download your guide right here, this little link, or in the description box, you can download the guide and follow along and get all of my motivational tips along the way. Okay, so today we are doing Crush On You, which is an amazing move to not only mobilize your hips and your ankles, but to find that really deep inner strength in your legs. Now, I have a chair here if you want to use it for balance, or you can try um, challenging your balance and see if you can use it, do the exercise without the chair. All right, so come into a second position like I have here. Usually it's gonna be a little bit outside of your shoulders, so feet a little bit outside of the shoulders. Go ahead and take a plie right here. Now what you're going to do is you're going to plie down, and then you're going to roll the ankles up like this. You're going to stand all the way up high onto your toes, and then lower the heels down just like that. So that is one rep. So you're gonna roll through a little bit faster all the way through like this. If it's too much with the arm, you don't have to use the arm, but that's what we'll be doing. So we'll do the first 50 with one arm if you wanna do the arms, and then we'll do the second one with the left, or you can try doing both arms without the chair. Okay, ready for this one? This one feels really good as far as um, finding balance, really your center balance and really strengthening your feet and ankles. Okay, here we go, make sure I'm at zero, and let's go. Lift up the heels all the way up and down, nice job. So squeeze that booty up at the top. Nice job, so I am just coming down with straight legs and then bending the legs. So you really do wanna articulate through every single move. So there's really a little moment of each movement, right? So there's a little pause in each one. And again, if the arm is too much, then you can just keep it down here like this and just focus on the legs. That might be easier the first couple times around. Good. Squeeze that booty at the top. Especially right here, when you're lowering down, that's really the key place where you wanna focus on squeezing the glute and resisting. So you don't wanna just like plop like that. Okay, you wanna make sure that you resist down. That's where you're gonna find a lot of your strength. Good. And squeeze. And squeeze. And again, you can try to let go of the chair here, see what happens. And play around with the position of the legs. You might need to scooch the legs in a little bit. You might notice that you have more balance or less balance, but find what works for you in your body. Now remember that we're just straight up and down, right? So I'm not sticking my booty out at all. I'll show you from the side. I'm really still like balancing a book over my head. Keep going. So really straight up and down. Whew. It's definitely more challenging to take your hand off of the chair. Just see what happens. You wanna keep your weight in your big toe. Try not to let the weight go towards your pinky toes because that's where, that's where you're gonna probably wobble off. Nice job. Keep the belly but butt pressing into the spine. Imagine that you're balancing a book on your head like those old school princesses but that's what it feels like. You wanna feel the length happening from the back of the neck. Beautiful job. These ones are a little bit slower. Keep going. All right, I'm gonna turn around and face you. Keep going. And again, challenge your balance. See what happens when you challenge here. Good work. Squeeze the booty. You're getting so strong with every single rep. And this is also going to help you uh, wear shoes easier, like wedges and heels like that. Lots of times I'll wear heels and honestly, it doesn't hurt me at all. I swear it's because I spent so many years working on my feet and ankles. So I'm able to wear heels and not uh, feel any pain. A lot of my friends are always like in so much pain. I'm like, ah, oh, I don't feel any 
do anything. <laughs> but it's because of doing things like this. It's going to help your overall body performance, athleticism. When you have strong feet, you can really do anything with that, right? Probably walk better, hike better, feel just more solid in your own two feet. Okay. We are halfway there. If you want to take the chair to the other side and uh, you know, experiment with the other arm. To see what that feels like. You want to always feel like the arm is moving through water. So it has this nice soft quality to it. stretchyfit100 so I can see your beautiful face and body doing all this amazing work. And don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel right here so I can continue to bring more free challenges and workouts to you. Now, if you are looking for an at-home workout program, then download my Stretchy Fit app. Join me in there and the rest of the community because you get a new workout every single day. Tons of variety with bar, yoga, 
HIIT workouts, it's amazing and you will stay consistent the way that the app is designed because you get a new workout every day and you get a program to check into and you can stay accountable. It is awesome and you will see your body goals come to life. It is amazing. Okay, I love you so much. Great job today and I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye.